just want to give you guys a big, just come here. Just, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's been too long, friends. It's been too long, too long. Y'all notice anything different? No? Wait till you see the other surprise that I'm going to show you guys in the next video. Or maybe a couple two more videos. Nothing different here. Nothing different here at all. <laughs> it is so hot in here. You should probably should sit on the fan. Yeah, let's make it happen. Oh yeah, that's better. <sighs> I've got some explaining to do. <laughs> At this point in the game, if you're watching this, I'm sure you have some idea that I have the tendency of ghosting my followers. I don't take pride in that at all. I'll be posting very frequently and often, and then I'll just stop out of nowhere with no warning. And that is no fault to anyone but my own or myself. Now, this isn't going to be a very long, drawn out video. This is basically just saying that I'm back. And I'm back for good. I'm starting off this video first and foremost with an apology because I do this so many times and it's for so many different reasons but the honest truth is because I'm just so afraid that being on social media so much it'll take over my life but I mean isn't that what will happen if you choose for social media to be your career you know for it to be what you do so in some shape or form it's gonna kind of have to take over your life just like how any other normal job and also i had a kid <laughs> i had a baby i felt like okay i wanted the full experience of being pregnant and having my first baby to just be between me and my husband but at the same time now that i'm looking back at it god i wish i documented so much more of that experience not just for anybody but for myself to look back on because it was it was pretty tough and that'll be in another whole YouTube video. But this one is just a let's try this again video. Let's start again. Let's start from scratch and do it in a way where there's no pressure. It's just passion and it's just fun. Because the way that it was for me, it wasn't either of those things. It was fun, but it was more of, oh my gosh, I want to make money. Let's dish all this out. Let's try and do the best that I can with what I have, which is what I always say. But it just wasn't working for me. I was putting so much pressure on myself because the content that I was dishing out wasn't to the quality that I wanted it to be. Although I was creating a following and I was creating engagement, even with the crappy uh, equipment that I did have, and that was okay. And I was doing fine. But again, I put that on myself and allowed the influence of other things, circumstances, things going on in my own personal life. And it all just came crashing down. So there's a lot of different things going on and I can't wait to share it all with you guys. I'm in a new place. We were in another place. We are going to be in another place. I mean, I had a baby. I had a baby period and you know did a little bit of something to my hair because i had a baby i did cut it after okay hold on i'm already getting into too much this is just my retraining i've missed this i've missed you i've oh my god you know when something is a passion of yours when all you can do is dream about it think about it and i don't know why i ever thought that i could do without it i could do without creating content and in YouTube and social media and connecting with people on a global scale. I, I don't know why I keep doing that to myself. All that to say is this is my return and I'm not gonna go anywhere. You know why? Because I bought an $1,100 camera and I need to get my butt moving. It, it, the investment that I made must see a return and I hope you stick around for it because there's so much more to come. Creating memories is the big deal for me. I hold on to things for so long, um, especially when it means so much to me like little moments here and there i notice watching my baby grow up and my marriage and my church family and my own personal family i just look back and i think man when we try to recall a time in our life or a time that something happened and we're trying to remember what happened i think to myself see if i had pursued my dreams of vlogging and creating content and creating memories and doing what I love here on YouTube, I'd have those moments. Maybe not all of them, maybe not every single one, but for the most part, yeah, 
I would have something. We can't ever get yesterday back, I understand that. But if I can capture it in a picture or a video and have that for as long as I can and to remember it and cherish it, that's why I'm here. And I hope you stick around. See you soon.